Hey guys, thank you for tuning in. We're back with another inside scoop on my latest project called Friends. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to be explaining a little bit about the meaning behind the song as well as how the track was created. So without further ado, let's jump on in. So the meaning behind the Friends project really started when I had experienced a few times within last year where I had trusted people thinking the best of them and hoping, you know, they would be who they say they would be and coming to find out later on that they didn't hold to that and honestly it was heartbreaking. And so within the chorus, you know, it says, sometimes we don't see so blind to the greed, it's hard to succeed with friends you don't need. And when I talk about the greed, it's not so much about a material greed, it can be a greed where you think you're gonna benefit from a friendship with somebody, therefore you keep that friendship. And that could be on both sides, whether that was on my side or on the other side, where you look at the situation as something you can benefit from, not for the purpose of building a friendship and relationship, but for the purpose of benefiting from that other person, and that's wrong. When it comes to friendship, you need to have both parties that bring value to each other, and if they don't, well then, I don't know if that's true friendship, you know? There's nothing wrong with one person maybe putting more into somebody else, but there should come a point where it balances out. You know, sometimes you need friends to help out others, but in regards to a genuine relationship with people, there should come a point where there's a mutual balance because you can't have one person putting in more effort than the other. And so within this whole track, it's just really, I had a broken heart and I just wanted to share what I understood about friendship out of a difficult trial that brought me to a new profound understanding that hey it's not just about having these people around but it's about making sure that you're on the same page and it's not about you benefiting from them it's about you being able to grow with them and, and understanding that you need to have patience with that and so this is probably one of my favorite tracks out of the album and mainly because it's so fresh to me still and the whole experience is so fresh to me and the way the track actually went about being created. I had kind of started putting together the chorus and then I started creating the beat around that. And I had contacted my friend Ken. I said, hey bro, would you be down to hop on this track with me and just talk about friendship? And, and he's somebody who was there for me when I experienced this trial. And so for him, it was very easy to apply the situation I experienced to the actual lyrics. So. He actually wrote about the things that I had shared with him, the things that I was heartbroken about and how I was treated. And he somehow beautifully put that together in his verse. So when it comes to the track being created, it was just this beautiful collection of, of experience and feedback that me and him are going back and forth. Cause Kenna also has experienced a lot of things with people where, you know, he's been heartbroken about things and having an expectation for people that they didn't reach and it was just really nice to have somebody who was there with me through the trial and then was with me after the trial and having understood why God allowed me to get through that and being able to write a track together. So that was honestly something truly beautiful that I have yet to experience with anyone. All right, that is it for today's Inside Scoop. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all of your time. Just so that you know, this next Inside Scoop is actually the last one that is taking place for this eight week journey that you have been joining me on. Once again, I don't have the words to explain my gratitude towards you for just enduring this uh, almost, yeah, pretty much two month long journey into this album. I've had an amazing time and there are some new fun things happening in the next coming weeks so make sure you stay tuned if you like and enjoyed what you got to see today make sure you hit the like and subscribe button and if you would like to comment and share anything that you've been touched by and or agree with or something maybe you've experienced with your friends that helps you relate to the song i would love to hear about it so other than that thank you so much for tuning in we'll catch you on the next inside scoop 
And if you'd like to just see more of what's going on, go ahead and make sure you check out my Instagram at I am Isaac Whedon. I am quite active on there, so you'll be able to kind of get more stuff in regards to what else is taking place musically and such. So, yeah. All right. God bless you. Catch you on the next one. Peace.